One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, 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 two, three, Hey, what's up, everybody, man? It's your boy, Jose Hustle. Right now, you're not tuned, huh? You are not tuned in to Jose Hustle TV. This is a Jose Hustle public service announcement. Something that I want, you know what I'm saying, adjust to my people, my fans, my followers. So don't adjust your TV screens. Don't adjust your computer sets. You know what I'm saying? You change a little scenery. But for right now, this is a public service announcement. Like a commercial on my TV show because my TV show is taking a break. You know what I'm saying? My writers are getting my season two together. But for today... You know what I'm saying? We are gonna discuss the ten hustle commandments. You know what I'm saying? We got we had God to put the ten commandments. Then we had Biggie to do the ten crap commandments. And then you have me, Jose Hustle, doing the ten hustle commandments. You know what I'm saying? I'm in just some hustle gear right now. I'm just you know fleshed up for real. I ain't got I ain't got my chain on. Got my fresh clothes. I'm about to go work out in a little bit. You feel what I'm saying? But you know, I'm about to go ahead and get into this right here because I feel I want to address to everybody the 10 hustle commandments. So, for number one, how do I say this? Your network is your net worth. You know what I'm saying? You gotta get out and talk to people. You gotta know who to talk to. You gotta get down. You gotta try, like what I said, you gotta try some plugs. Because that's gonna determine how much you're gonna make, how much you're gonna be worth. If it depends on who you know and how you know them, and you know what I'm saying? How strong your plug is. If you can come through for them, I guarantee they can come through for you. Ask anybody who's my plug or I'm their plug. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Number two, image is everything. You know what I'm saying? Image is everything. You gotta look to you gotta look the best that you can at all times. Cause you never know who you're gonna meet. You never know who you're gonna run into. You never know how the situation gonna play itself out. So I suggest you always wanna be looking good. Always wanna stay on your toes. Always wanna be on your P's and Q's. Cross your T's and dot your I's. Cause for real, you'll never know whose eyes is watching when you're crossing your T's. I'm gonna tell you like this, man. Stay looking good. Stay looking nice. I am the freshest nigga ever, as I told you all. But I'm telling y'all, y'all should wanna be the freshest niggas and women ever also. So that's how you get that's how you get your clothes, that's how you hustle. If you look like one, I guarantee you gonna learn how to make it. That's a little point from Jose Hustle right there. You know what I'm saying? Another thing, the early bird gets the worm. That's number three. The early bird gets the worm. Niggas always ask me, Jose Hustle, why do you wake up so early? Or how do you do it? I feel man, you know, I get up around like five, six, seven, between between six and eight every day. You know what I'm saying? I feel like if I wake up late, I'm missing out on something. I'm missing out on some money, some opportunities, all kinds of stuff. So I'm 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 just up. I'm just up. It might not be nothing to do at the time, but I'll be ready, I'll be up and ready when I hit it, get the call where I ain't gotta be like. Oh shit, oh, I'm about to get up in a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I'm already up. I'm ready to get that money. Shouts out to the bread, man. He taught me how to do that. You know what I'm saying? Number four, it's lonely at the top. Yeah, when you start doing big things, when you start making good money, and when you start branching out, you get to the top, it's lonely. Everybody can relate to what you do. If, if, I like, if I'm up here, which I project myself to be in a couple weeks, and then if, and all my other people are down here, it's lonely. They can't relate. So yeah, you're going to feel by yourself at times. You're going to feel lonely. But trust me, your money will be your friend. Whoever said money can't buy happiness didn't know where to shop. Because I damn sure can buy happiness. I know where to shop. And I stay looking good after I get done shopping. Number five, successful opportunity meets preparation. You know what I'm saying? You got to know where to go. You got to prepare. You got to prepare for the opportunity. You got to already be ready to make that break. You got to already be ready. You got to put yourself in that position. I'm trying to tell y'all. I'm preaching to y'all. I put it on the platter. Now all you got to do is take your fork and your napkin and eat and wipe off when the little stuff get out. We get dirty because it's going to get rough. But you got to be prepared for all that. You know what I'm saying? Number six. Business is personal. Don't get, don't let a nigga be like, man, it ain't nothing, it, it's just business, it ain't nothing personal. Your business is personal because with business comes with money. And money is your personal asset, it's your way to distinguish yourself. That is, that is how you establish yourself in the world, with money. And without business, you can't do it. So take all business as personal. A nigga want to give you a bad deal, take that shit personal. You want what I'm saying? Don't let a nigga be like, man, this ain't, this is just business is nothing personal don't don't listen to that shit because all business is personal number seven everything is negotiable everything this lotion is negotiable this phone is nego everything's for sale put it like that 
I will I will auction off this pill. I will sell you this pillow to get what I need. You want to buy this shirt off my back? You can get it for the right price. I ain't going to say it's going to be a low price, but for the price I want it, you can get it. You know what I'm saying? Let everything go for sale because you can always get it back. Just best believe if you bought it once, you can damn sure buy it twice. They didn't stop making it after they made yours. Remember that. So if you can buy it once, you can buy it twice. Don't let it. Don't be like, oh, man, it's a keepsake, man. Sell that shit. You know what I'm saying? Number eight. It's not what you know or who you know is what hold on hold on is who let me let me look back on my on my notes it's not what you know or who you know it's who knows you you know what i'm saying i had it wrong i know y'all can excuse that but who knows you yeah a lot of people go to school they learn a lot which is great i would con hope everybody continues to do that and a lot of people have clubs like myself but then at the same time you gotta make sure people know who you are you know what I'm saying? So when they can see your name on that resume, or see your name on that beat, or, or, or whatever, or a sheet of paper in that press box, or, or on the stat sheet, they need to know who you are. You know what I'm saying? That's how you hustle. That's how you do it, man. Number nine, it takes dough to make bread. It takes money to make money. Remember that. You can't go, you can't make a pizza without dough. You gotta have bread. You can't go make a million dollars if you ain't got nothing to make it off of. You know what I'm saying? You gotta have money to make money. You gotta invest. You gotta spend a little money. I'ma spend 50 so I can make a hundred. Or I'ma spend a hundred so I can make 300. That, that's how it goes, man. That's how you gotta use. You, a broke nigga cannot be considered a hustler. You gotta have money to make money. It's plain and plain and simple. You know what I'm saying? Number 10. This is this is the most important one, I believe. You know, you gotta believe in yourself. You gotta know that you can do it. You gotta feel that you are the number one hustler in the game besides Jose Hustle. You gotta know that shit because if you don't believe in who is, trust me. If, if you walking down the street, man, I, I don't think I can do that. The next nigga will be like, okay, well I don't think you can do it either since you saying if you don't believe in yourself. You're not convincing me to believe in you. So you gotta believe in yourself. You gotta get down and grind. You gotta get down and be able to do it, man. Because I'm telling you, it's rough out here. But with Jose Hustle, these commandments, these principles I got, I'm laying on y'all. Y'all take that shit, put it in good use, man, because I'm not bullshitting with y'all. I'm for real out here. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to... Mm, what am I, I'm trying to bring everybody up to my level. I'm not above anybody by a significant amount, but I feel I got an edge that a lot of people don't have, that they still trying to cut the corner, but I didn't cross it and went back two or three, four times. But I'm going to tell you like this. Memorial Day Mayhem 2009. Get your mind right. Get your grind tight because it's coming 21st through the 24th. If I sent you an invite, you better be there. If you, don't, if you miss that shit, you just missing out on a lifetime opportunity to network, hustle, come up and grind or whatever. But look, I'm out. My, my commercial is about to go off, so uh, stay tuned in to Jose Hustle TV. New episode coming up real soon. God bless Jose Hustle.